What happens when you release an unprecedented new piece of hardware to a select group of hardcore geeks? They immediately try to hack it, of course. But this time, Google is actually encouraging developers to hack its new Glass product. Duh, as one Google engineer tweeted, Glass is hackable. Apparently, there's a simple route in the software that's achievable by entering debug mode. And in fact, Google actually sponsored a session this week at Google I.O. called Voiding Your Warranty, Hacking Glass, aiming to encourage experimental application development. As far as the initial Mirror API goes, Google laid out some ground rules that some developers complain are too limiting, prohibiting, for example, real-time analysis of images. But it's very telling that Google has all but sanctioned app development outside of those initial guidelines. One development team has already built a facial recognition app intended for use by medical professionals. The app called MedRef for Glass allows doctors to find and create patient folders through voice and photo notes and identify patients through facial recognition technology. The app uses an open API for that called Betaface. Google will obviously have a ton of issues to work out, like the many privacy concerns surrounding wearable technology in advance of the commercial launch of Glass. But these hacks, as they're called, will likely play a huge part in shaping what role this tech will take in our lives in the future. What can you see this being used for? Are you a developer with ideas on how to make the most of Glass? Let us know in the comments. For TFN, this is Annie. And make sure you check out today's Factor Fictional, where Veronica takes a look at if we could ever have plasma guns in real life. Click the link to the left.